we just got the new Amave Discovery set in the mail. And this is a limited time offer. And we thought that we would do a live unboxing mm-hmm. with my sweet hubby, Mark Ritchie, so he can give us the lowdown of his thoughts on this and what we think, because guys like doTERRA too. Proterra. Right, babe? Proterra. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we're going to go through this together. Um, and I'm going to walk you through it while Mark tries these. So the first one that we're going to start with is the Amavi Rosso. So we'll have you open that up, Mark. Ooh. Okay. So this is, it says an exhilarating statement of masculine strength and confidence. It's citrusy with a, just a little kind of hint of metal. It helps with energy and success. And this is a blend of cedarwood, bergamot, and you're actually just going to spray them. Um, cedarwood, bergamot, amorous, wild orange, bergamot mist, bergamot mint, pepper, coriander, vetiver, litsia, patchouli. There's actually a lot of oils in this blend. Lavender, geranium. Do you need a little help? A little help. Okay, a little help. Real life here. Oh, interesting. <laughs> we're having trouble we're having technical difficulties okay let me see your hand see if we can spray this out i'm not sure what happened let's see let's start with another one and come back to this one <laughs> grab another one babe yeah. oh i can't smell it here can you smell it oh yeah okay that one is really good mm-hmm. all right grab another one let's see the Noir, noir. Okay. Here, let's do this one. Where should we spray it on your arm? Oh, there we go. So if you didn't know, when you smell an essential oil, it smells a little bit different on the skin than it does when you smell it out of the bottle. So this is the noir. It is kind of dark, sweet aroma. It's got cedarwood, bergamot, amorous. So this is a great thing, ladies. I don't know about you, but I'm really sensitive to chemicals and scents and smells. And these are nice that the guys can have something that smells good. That doesn't cause headaches or toxic issues when you're inhaling them, especially I notice it at the gym, the guys who wear a lot of cologne, it'll give me an instant headache or migraine. So this is kind of a nice one. I like that. Mm -hmm. What do you think? I like this one. Yeah. That smells good. Mm Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm liking this one. All right. Let's look at the next one is the Azul. Azul. Ooh. Okay. So Azul is, it says it captures the aroma of freedom and adventure. So ladies, if you need gift ideas for Father's Day, this would be a good one. This one's more woodsy, I think. Oh yeah. It's a lot more woodsy. So Azul definitely feels very outdoorsy kind Mm -hmm. of a vibe. Mm Mm-hmm. A lot of those grounding oils. Let's see. Azul is cedarwood, Douglas fir, mm-hmm. lime, bergamot, labdamum, spearmint, cardamom, a lot of, a lot of trees. So we're going to call Azul the woodsy Azul. one. Azul is the woodsy one. Noir. What would you call Noir? Noir smells like a traditional cologne. Yeah. That's kind of like your go to mm-hmm. cologne for, for the men. Yeah. Okay, which one do you like the best so far? Um, let me give this one a try, see if we can get this bottle to work. I think were you trying to take it off instead of spray it? Yeah, I thought is it was I thought it was sealed. So this is good to know. <laughs> Don't take it off, just spray it. Otherwise, let's see if we can get it working. Oh, there you go. There, there, goes, you go. there you go. There it goes. We fixed it. Got it. Ha ha. Okay. So this is the Rosso. Rosso. They're blending together. Awesome. Hang on. I need to. Here, spray on me. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Here. Ooh. Ooh. I like that one too. That reminds me of like a non toxic old spice. There you go. Is that what it smells like a to you? Bit. More citrusy, minty, kind of. Yeah. Oh, I think I like that one the best. They're all good. Mm -hmm. They're all good. So Mark was a big fan of the Amave collection. And this is like the next, the next step with the discovery set a little bit goes a long ways with this, my friends, you just need a little bit. So there's, they're 1.5 ML little spray bottles in these. 
So one or two sprays is all you need. Mm -hmm. Less is more with the essential oils. But I wonder, since we kind of opened up one, if we could make a roller out of these. Probably. And, and top with like a carrier oil and use it as a roller. Cause Mark uses the Amave, which is a roller blend to have on hand. Right. What do you think? Oh, y'all are sending the sweetest messages over. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Mark will dance for you. <laughs> oh, wait, I didn't, I didn't know that. Hang on. <laughs> Whoa. Uh oh, now, now it's just gone serious right now. Okay. So what do you think? What is, what is your favorite? I kind of like. The noir the best because it's kind of a. I like the the this is the woodsy one right. The the noir is like the. No no this is like the traditional. That's like kind of the traditional cologne. Yes. It smells like a traditional cologne. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're Which all good, good in their own way. See, and then the guys can smell good, and nobody gets migraines or headaches or anything, and everybody's feeling good. Like yeah, because nobody likes that. Okay, you like the input on this? Yeah, this is real life. Mark will Mark will not lie. <laughs> He'll tell you his honest truth. I'll be honest, the Azul, meh. I mean, it definitely smells like being in a forest. Yeah. Right? Like it's it's the more here, we need to have like a hand for each one. So this will be our Azul hand. It's yeah, it's woodsy. I feel it's like it's very woodsy. I feel like you already have a roller that has that that aroma to it you know maybe like, northern escapage yeah, is probably like the best way to describe yeah, that yeah okay but i feel like these other two are more unique the other two smell like cologne more unique cologne blend right especially noir yeah yes okay kurt asks, will you actually use this yes i will actually use this <laughs> to be perfect after shaving yes Yes. Okay. So let's do, let's do it one more time. Less, less feedback. Let's do the noir on this, this one. Yep. That one's my favorite. That one's your favorite. Yeah. It does smell like traditional cologne. It's mm -hmm. a little bit sweeter. Mm -hmm. Does it seem more powerful of a smell? If you love Northern escape, you're going to like the Azul. Because it definitely yes. smells foresty, mm -hmm. woodsy. If your guy likes foresty, woodsy, treesy stuff, that's Azul's gonna be his one. jam. Yeah. If they like the traditional cologne smell, noir. Noir. If you want something more citrusy, minty, we okay. do the rose. Let me spray myself. Yeah. <laughs> all the Indians all starting to blend together. Yeah. Kind of a citrusy minty one. This one, Rosso smells like Old Spice to me, like a non-toxic Old Spice. Like it mm. reminds me of my dad. My dad growing up would wear Old Spice. And when I smell it, I think of him. That limbic system and how everything is reminded. The Amave smells very light. Yeah, the Amave does smell very light and subtle. These are a little more kick to them than the traditional Amave. What do you yes, think? Yes, I would agree. This one's kind of light though. This one's the lightest. The Rosso is the, the Rosso lightest. The Rosso is the lightest. Yep. <laughs> Good question which would i rather smell oh yeah this one <laughs> rosa rosa like oh man date night <laughs> cologne Woo -woo. which one do you want honey <laughs> this is gonna be the date night cologne okay maybe you really like the noir yes I do. so maybe that's gonna be your daily mm -hmm. like going to the office yep. i'm glad we we're able to fix it when we broke it <laughs> so yeah here. So I accidentally twisted it off, but if you just keep pushing down, because it's like a spray. It's a spray. It will, it will sync back up and you can use it again. So, so don't twist it. Don't twist but it. But if you do, just spray it. you can salvage it. I thought it was it. sealed underneath. That's why I twisted it off. <laughs> but it's not sealed. It's just ready to go. Yeah. Yeah. And this is amazing because I can smell all the, I'm super sensitive to colognes. Like the last family gathering that we did his is my father-in-law the cologne was actually giving me a, a migraine and mm -hmm. i had to kind of step out so i love that we're smelling them all and i feel great i don't have any migraines or sensitivities so if you're like me and you can't walk down the cleaning aisle of a grocery store or walk into a bath and body work store or if it's a hot mess you'll do well with this of course it's about what the wives girlfriends would like yeah if yep. you have this you'll have to let us know what's your favorite what's your husband's favorite and then what's mm -hmm. your favorite be both sides happy wife happy life yes yeah, so true is that, a thing? that is a real thing oh my gosh <laughs> yes 
Okay, any other feedback that we can share? Any other questions that you have about these blends? Yes. They're available for a limited time. A little goes a long ways. I'm really curious about making my own roller with this. I think that that would be fun, even though they're not meant to do that, but I like to break the rules a little bit too. Uh, so these are available for Father's Day. They are $21 for the kit and you can get all three. They are spray. Um, they're awesome. So yeah, we're going to say Rozo is your non-toxic old spice mm -hmm. and Azul is your woodsy one. Woodsy one. Yep. Kelly will probably like the Azul. Yes. There you go. That's the woodsy foresty one. Yep. And then the Noir we're going to say is your, your traditional cologne. Your traditional cologne yep. For that. Yeah. Oh, yay. I'm glad. Okay. I'm glad that this is helpful. And when you get it, let us know what you think. Yep. Let us know your favorites. And let us know which, your, which one is your favorite. But I like that they mixed up. But I, I'm excited. Do you, do you want to see more men's stuff in doTERRA? I know I do. You do. Broterra. Let us, let us know, Broterra, if, if the guys, because I feel like the guys need it. And I honestly wish that I could just spritz this on people in the gym and tell them to stop using <laughs> the actual <laughs> Old Spice cologne because it gives us migraines. I'd rather smell sweat than, than that stuff. A little bit, a little it bit. It brings on the migraines. It's hard. You're trying to get your husband to stop buying it. Oh, the cool water. Oh, yes. Remember cool water? Oh, man. What was the, there was, what was it? Like American Eagle had like a cologne or different ones. Remember that? Mine was. Uh, what was yours? What was, what did you go to? Was it like uh, Ralph? You Ralph Polo. Polo. Polo Mark Sports. wore Polo, Polo Sport. Sport. Polo. Yeah. Yep. And when we first started dating, he wore a lot of it. When we first started dating. <laughs> we got him off that though. Dirty. He Dirty. found the way. <laughs> he found the way to doTERRA. I'm so proud of you. And you used to be an Irish Springs soap guy. Mm -hmm. And we got you to swap to the doTERRA soap. Yep. It took a long time, but we finally got him off of the Crest toothpaste. Colgate. Cool. Colgate. Cool. Yep. Garbage, garbage. We finally got him on that. When doTERRA on came out with the mint toothpaste, because I need mint in my toothpaste. It took the mint. You didn't like the original On Guard one. I didn't. He couldn't hang so. with it. So when they- Mint the, for the win. The new On Guard toothpaste with the hydroxy appetite, he was on board with. Yeah. You're all about the Broterra. Your boyfriend loves the oils. Yes, I love it. Cool water. Tommy Hill figure. <laughs> Paul loves for Paul yes. For it. yes. Okay. Yeah, doTERRA back. needs more stuff for the men. So if you want doTERRA to have more stuff for the men, go and add this to your cart and go and get this. You'll have to process your order right away because it's a limited time offer. Mm -hmm. Because the thing is, and I was talking to a couple people in doTERRA, the guy's stuff, it doesn't sell. It doesn't do as well. So, so prove wrong. Yeah. Shut so vote, vote with your dollar. Go, yes. and, go and add this. Vote with your wallet. They see a big response to this. And this is probably why they're doing it in a little demo kit to start to see if people really love it. But I do agree. doTERRA needs more. Guys need oils too. Mm -hmm. And we're, we're bringing, we're bringing it. Mm -hmm. This is, this is fun. You smell good. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks doTERRA. <laughs> All right. Anything else that we can help? Yeah. Oh yeah. Migraine cocktail, cigarette smoke, old lady perfume, <laughs> cologne, Gluten. Gluten. Yeah, it's all a disaster. <laughs> so it's nice that we have options for this. Do you want to see more of Mark Ritchie on videos? Because I feel like this is quite fun. I don't know. He does more than just dance. <laughs> <laughs> you have a few in your car. Yes. Yeah. A couple of them up. This is good. But I, I really do it. It's a good one. Sure. It's a good one. Should we tell the crazy story about when you took people to lunch? This is how sensitive oh, yes. I am to toxins and smells. Yep, you tell that. Tell them. I got into the car. In my car. Into Mark's car, mm -hmm. and could smell cologne. And I was like, and he knows not to wear cologne around me. And traditional cologne. I was like, babe, like I started getting migraine. I was like, something is not right. What what is going on here? He was like, I'm not wearing cologne. I'm not. And hadn't worn cologne in. I said, years. I smell cologne. And you thought about it, and you were like, I drove the guys to to lunch. A couple the days day, before, day or two before, and it was still lingering in the car. It was still lingering. So this is a telltale sign that you're dealing with a synthetic fragrance, is when it lingers for days, and that's a big difference with the essential oils. You'll smell them if you're using a pure pharmaceutical grade oil. You'll smell them when they're in the diffuser when you roll them on, but it's not going to be like that forever. It's not like those car air fresheners or the Febreze or those videos where you wash your laundry and then 
it smells like that weeks later. No, that is so harmful for your health. So you actually don't want scents that just linger forever and ever because that's a telltale sign that you're dealing with a synthetic fragrance. Mm -hmm. Oh man, Mm -hmm. so fun to hang with you. Okay, any last minute thoughts, ideas, anything else that you want to share? I think if I was going to rank them for me, I would rank them Noir. Mm. Oh. Azul. Really? And then Rosso. I know you, Rosso is your favorite. Oh man, so. Rosso is my favorite. So I would say <laughs> Rosso. Rosso Noir. Noir. Noir Teal. Oh, this yeah. one. This one. And then the Azul three yep. for me. There you go. There you Give go. it a try. There's your Richie rankings. If you try it out, let us know what you think. Let us know if you agree with Mark with his favorite ones. We're here to help you smell good without the toxins. One man at a time. <laughs> <laughs> one, one husband, one boyfriend, one guy. <laughs> Doterra's new slogan, one <laughs> man at a time. <laughs> Helping you <laughs> heal in the world. <laughs> We're here for it. Do you want to close this out with a dance? Um, <laughs> oh, da, da, da. yeah. We have a very special movement Monday coming for you. Oh, yes. A very special guest. Special guest. So stay tuned Move for that. Monday. Yep. First Monday in June. Look out. A little preview for there. There you go. All right. We are so glad that you're here. Thanks for hanging with us. We'll see you soon. And if you try out the new Amave Discovery Kit, let us know what your favorite is. And don't pull it off. Just Yeah, don't twist it off. Don't twist it off. It's ready to use <laughs> right on the box. Just, just use it there. Just plug and play. <laughs> and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.